On February 23 this year, US President Joe Biden had said, Ajay is uniquely equipped to lead the World Bank at this critical moment in history. Biden is confident of Ajay Banga's experience in tackling urgent issues like climate change. But as the new president of the World Bank, Banga's biggest challenge is the weakening of support for global multilateral institutions like the World Bank itself. Established in 1944, the World Bank is an international organization that provides financing, advice and research to developing nations to aid their economic reforms. It is not a standalone entity, but a group of five separate institutions. All these institutions perform different functions. The IBRD provides credit to middle-income and low-income countries. The IDA offers interest-free credit to the poorest countries. The International Finance Corporation is focused on the private sector and promotes sustainable development. Although the World Bank started with 44 member countries, today it boasts more than 180 members. The IBRD has the highest number of members at 189, while ICSID is low at 158 members. The World Bank is governed by a board of governors, which is made up of representatives from each of its member countries. Over the years, commitments and disbursements by the World Bank to various countries have increased. In 2018, the World Bank Group committed $74,265 million and disbursed $45,724 million. In 2022, it increased to $104,370 million worth of commitments and $67,041 million disbursements. The World Bank Group has two ambitious goals, ending extreme poverty and boosting shared prosperity. It works towards reducing the share of the global population that lives in extreme poverty to 3% and increasing the incomes of the poorest 40% of people in every country. To this end, in 2022, the World Bank Group lent $9 billion to the South Asian region. The lending was through its two institutions, IBRD and IDA. Transportation sector received the highest share at 24% of the total lending. This was followed by the health sector with a share of 19%. Over the years, the World Bank Group has played a key role in shaping the global economy and reducing poverty. It has also been criticized for its lending practices and focus on promoting economic growth over social and environmental concerns. How it evolves and achieves its missions, especially with its first ever Indian origin precedent, will be critical in the making of an equitable world. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.